while justifying his arrest and prolonged detention the uttar pradesh government had told supreme court that kerala journalist sadiq kapan had deep links with terror funding organizations like popular front of india and its student wing campus front of india the claim was denied by kapan and his counsel popular front of india or pfi as it is known in common parlance is an outfit which has been in the eye of storm since its formation created in 2007 pfi describes itself as the organization that fights for the rights of minorities dalits and marginalized communities the decision to form the organization was made on november 22 2006 in korikod kerala and it is headquartered in new delhi pfi was founded after merging three islamic organizations in southern india the national democratic front the karnataka forum for dignity and the manidha nidhi pasarai the organization does not contest elections but carries on social and religious work among muslims another outfit the social democratic party of india or sdpi emerged from pfi in 2009 it raises political issues for muslims dalits and other marginalized communities pfi provides ground workers to sdpi pfi has been repeatedly accused of riots murders and having links with terrorist organizations in the state in 2012 then chief minister of kerala umman chandi told the high court that pfi is nothing but a resurrection of the banned outfit simi the chandi government also filed an affidavit saying that pfi workers were involved in 27 murder cases most of those killed were from the rss and cpm but pfi workers are not the only ones accused of murders the age old rivalry between rss and cpm has seen hundreds from both the sides losing their lives to violent attacks pfi is the new entrant to this club in april 22nd a subair pfi president of elapuli was killed outside a mosque the police said that the killer's vehicle was registered under the name of s sanjit a slain rss worker sanjit was allegedly killed in november 2021 allegedly by the workers of pfi and sdpi in april 2022 SK Srinivasan another RSS worker was hacked to death in Palakkad Abu Bakar Siddiq PFI secretary for Palakkad was arrested in September on the charge of Srinivasan's murder Abu Bakar was also arrested in 2020 for inciting violence during the anti CAA protests If you like this video share it and subscribe to Business Standard For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn.